Media. Quick tips. Here's how to do a quick and easy text reveal effect with Vegas Pro. So here we are in the editor, and as you can see, I'm using this nice picture as a background. So first, I'll right click on the empty video track above and choose Insert Text Media. And I'm going to type the first part of the message. Just reduce the size a tad and pick a font that reflects the message. And I'll just stretch that to fit. Now I need the second part of the message, the bits to be revealed. And I want it in the same style and font. So as a shortcut, I'm just going to copy this and paste it onto the track above. And then simply edit the text. And there we go. And now I can simply resize it and place it to fit. OK, so I'll just trim the clip back to the point where I want the word to reveal itself. And I'm going to add a 4 second fade. And I'm just going to have to trim the clips a bit to make it fit. And there we go. So let's just check that fade. Yep, that looks fine. Now we're going to add a transition to the fade. So click Transitions, choose Linear Wipe, then Top Down Hard Edge, and just drop it onto the fade like this. And if we run it, we can see the transition in action. Next, we need to construct a bar that will fall down to reveal the word. So insert another video track above if you haven't got one, right click on it, and choose Insert Generated Media then Sony Solid Colour. There we go, and I'll just trim it to fit. Now the default colour is white, but you can change it to any colour you wish by clicking here. OK, now click on the Event Pan Crop tool here, and select the very first key point on the Mask track, that's the bottom one, and check the Mask box here for good measure. Now select the Rectangular Mask Creation tool, and using your mouse, create a long thin box like this. And I'm just going to adjust it so that it looks like it's underlining the first words. Like this. By the way, if your screen looks like this, then you need to set this mode box to positive. And there you go. Now we need to set a fade on the end of this clip that is exactly the same length as the other fade. So I'll just measure it against the first like this. And I'll just take a look at that. And that's fine. Now it's transition time again. And this time we need the slide transitions. Then select slide out top down. And drop it onto the fade. Now we need to synchronize the two transitions. So choose a point about halfway along the text fade, and shuttle back and forth with the shuttle buttons like this until the text is half formed. Now slide in the mask track until the line exactly butts up to the edge of the text. They are now synchronized, and you can trim the front of the track to match the rest. If you now play through the transitions, you can see how the line appears to drop and reveal the text. And that's it! The effect is complete. All that remains now is to render to video, and this is what you get. Well, that's your lot. If you've enjoyed this video, then please subscribe, like and share. And don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified of new videos as they come out. This has been a Media Quick Tip, and I have been William Hugh.